Fair far, your honest sonsy face, great chieftain of the hooded race, aboon the man attack your place, spange drip or firm. Weel are you worthy, O oh, a grace, as long as my arm. The groaning trencher there you fill, your herbies like a distant hill, your pin will help to mend the mill in time of need. Well, through your pores the Jews distill like amber bead. His knife, say rest that labour deeked, and cut you up already slicked, trenching your gushing into his bleed like honey ditch. And oh, what a glorious sight, warm, beacon, rich. Then horn for horn they stretch and strive, deal tap the hindmost on they drive, draw the wheels full of kites below and bent like drums. Till all good man less like to ride, he thanked the tubs. Is there a doubt his French should I do? Or all the old would stow a suit? Or frigacy? We'd make a spew at Burp and Scona. <laughs> Looks down with sneering scorp of you and sit at dinner. Poor devil see him out his trash, his feckless as a withered rash, his spindled shank a good whip lash, his knee in it. Through bloody flood or field the dash, oh, how unfit. But mark the rust that had his fed, the trembling earth resounds his tread, clapping his wild even blade, the old mucket whistle, and legs and arms and heads will sled like taps of thristle. He powers that map mankind her care, and dish her out her bill there. Old Scotland wants nice skin can wear the chops and muggies. But if you wish for a grateful prayer, hear the haggis.